Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Allie, if you're new here. I upload, um, I do beauty Bible and lifestyle, so if any of those interest you, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let's go ahead and get into today's video. So in today's video, I have for you guys, just a second. <sighs> Can y'all tell what it is? This is like two months. <laughs> This is like two months of product empties, you guys. I don't know how to do this. So we are gonna go ahead and go through this and I'll just pull this. everything out one by one, but I finally have my product empties for you guys and I need to fix Bryson's transformers or he's going to lose his marbles. So let me set this down, fix his transformer and I'll be right back. So the first thing we have is one of these big downies. I buy this size at Costco and I usually get it when it's on sale for like 12 bucks or I think, I don't know. I get it for really cheap, but it's like a, the price of like the biggest bottle that you can get at like regular stores. But I get, so I did go through one of those and I usually go through one of these about every two-ish months, I would say. And I mean, it's a fabric softener. I never use very much fabric softener just because I don't like for my clothes to feel too soft. So that's why this lasts me forever. Okay, so since these two items are kind of the same, we're gonna go ahead and talk about them. I have these Downy um, scent boosters. This one I get from Costco, this one I got from H-E-B. This bigger size, um, I didn't realize the size difference, so I seen them right by each other, but I prefer this scent over this one. I don't know why, but you, you can find this one in this ginormous size, but I really do prefer this scent really good um i do notice like the scent on the clothes last for a really long time even if it's just hanging up in the closet or in the drawers forever it still smells like fresh laundry you know like sometimes it can get not like a mildewy smell but like it can just kind of smell like it hasn't been worn in a while using these like that doesn't happen so this one has the same effect i just prefer this scent which is the cool cotton Okay, next up, went through about four, uh, or this one's actually empty. It holds 41 packs. I'm pretty sure I've filled this up twice and then I finally got rid of this container. So about 160 packs in about two months, not too shabby. And I think I have the smaller packs in here if I'm not mistaken. What else did we go through? Went through some kids' vitamins. Um, yeah, so the Kirkland brand of vitamins, I like those, they like them. I prefer chewables rather than gummies just because chewables have iron. Gummies don't really hardly ever have iron, so I prefer the chewables, but I am like the hard ones, but it's easier to find gummies everywhere you go. Went through a pack of Theraflu because the McKithen household has been going through it. I currently have two in the room with high fevers. Bryson has a low grade fever and he's acting normal, but the other two are just out of it, which is Ethan and King. But th this household been going through it. No, it's not the virus. We're just something viral, but it's not the virus. And we're just allowing our bodies to do its thing. So yeah, they're a flu. Okay, we went through one thing of Unstoppable's Touch Fabric Spray. I really like this, especially if you have an open concept house, it's really easy for the smell to like get stuck like in the carpet, in the furniture. And so I really just like this for that and just like spraying it down at the end of the night, cleaning up and then I spray it first thing in the morning and then I feel like this smell of food doesn't last as long in my house. So I've been watching TikTok and I have the one that's trending right now that's like, Go little rock star. I'm gonna make one to that. So in the last two months, we went through two mouthwashes, pretty usual for us. Um, yeah, two mouthwashes, we really like this one. We buy the three pack at Costco. And yeah, I feel like that one leaves your mouth feeling clean forever. We went through an Everspring um, room spray. So this is just like an air freshener we use for the bathroom, so whenever we go poop. And I really like these, and then they're not as harmful as most air sprays. So, yeah, that's what we're going with for the air sprays. Okay, we went through two body washes, one of the Kirkland brand, and then I packed up all the rest of our Kirkland brand, so I had to stop and like I had to been going to the store to buy body wash and so we went through one of the native ones i really like the native body wash we have another one in there right now that we're probably about to use up but this is a really good line of body washes and i also wonder why the body wash is cheaper than the toothpaste and deodorant it makes no sense to me but really good body wash 
we finished up, well, mostly I finished up the Dr. Till's Foaming Bath, the Sleep Bath. I would use this on really tough nights that I couldn't fall asleep. And I'm telling you, anything from this Dr. Till's Melatonin will have you passed out. Anything from it will have you passed out. All right, we have this Lubiderm Dermatologist tested. Oh, I'm really reading everything. Anyways, lotion. I really like this lotion. I feel like it could be a little bit thicker because it does moisturize. It just doesn't keep you moisturized for long. Like I like to feel like the smoothness on my skin. Well, at least for me, it keeps me moisturized, but not for like my boys or for Brian. And so, I don't know. I did get the extra dry skin one too, but it's um, we haven't finished using up these ones yet. So I'll let you know how the extra dry or intense moisture one works. if. So this is just the daily moisture. I wonder if the intense one, which is has like the red, is better. So we shall see. All right, and we are getting down to the smaller stuff. Okay, so I used up this um, Neutrogena Skin Balance Gel Cleanser. I really, really like that. It's like it's my it's my go-to cleanser. I'm always using it. I also used up some um, two packs of these. I've used up two packs of the Oval. They're like the premium cotton rounds I used to pack up from Target, and then I used this pack up from HEB. Um, the ones from HEB are really intense and really good quality. I went through a collagen face mask. I used that face mask within the last two months. Um, I used a ton of eye masks. Let me see if I can find them. God, we just have, have had some late night, early mornings. Okay guys, I think that's up oh, one more. Okay, so I repair mask is healthy hydration from Ulta. We use one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So about one mask a week we went through. Um, I used up on another sheet of those um, acne dope um, Alba, Alba brand acne dope. They're like the pimple pouches. Used up one of those. Um, Went through an Equate Beauty um, clarifying charcoal cleanser. This is a cleanser that I use at nighttime. I finally used up, I don't know if you guys ever watched my Ipsy unboxings, but I had got this, the new company, the Pill All-in-One Serum. Used that up. I really liked this serum, but I believe it's really expensive. That's why I didn't buy it. Um, used up this little Sugar Cosmetics Fresh Rose Water. That was pretty good. If you're looking for a good like little indie brand, I highly recommend Sugar Cosmetic for lashes. She has body lotions now. She has all kinds of stuff. Like check it out. My handle broke off of my basket. Um, so I went through my Dr. Brandt um, eye cream. This is their retinol eye cream, and I'm so so sad about it because I'm using one now, and it's just not the Dr. Brandt one. And I can tell the difference. Used up this sugared, uh, raw sugar deodorant. I really love this brand. This smells really good. It's not completely gone, but there's just no way for me to apply it anymore in my armpits. And that was the lavender lemon sugar. Used up another Aunt Jackie's Curl Boss. Oh, I used up two of those within the last two months because I use it on myself and the boys. So used up two of those. That's how you know I swear by this because I'm working on my third container now. Look, baby. You don't know what to do? You make the puzzle, so you have to bring the pieces up here. All right, and then we used a rose mask from Ulta Beauty. Um, finally ran out of my little lip, my lip therapy rosy lips from Raquel that she gave me. I really, really like that stuff. I used up the Hey Humans um, deodorant. I lost the lid, but I did use that up. Went through my Ulta Beauty brow pencil. I love this brow pencil. And if they go on sale again, I'm going to be stocking up on them. They're really, really good. Um, finally used up this Argon Oil from OGX. Not a fan of it. It's really too thick for my hair, but it was great for the boys' hair. Oh, really. oh yeah. And then I did go through this Anomaly shampoo and conditioner. You find this at Target. It was really good. Like, I really loved my curls whenever I was using that brand. It was super good. We went, I told y'all, we've been going through it. Went through a Zarbies cough syrup. I feel like you have, this works, but you have to give it to them every two to four hours rather than letting them go to six hours, I believe it is. I give it to my boys every two to four hours. 
Um, and, it, and it keeps their cough at bay. And then like this one has the help with the mucus. So that one's really good. We went through a Crest White toothpaste, um, a Dove. This is, for, this is what I use for my private parts. This is just a Sensitive Skin Dove Soap Bar. Okay, and then Brian used up the Degree Men's. He really likes this one, doesn't really complain about it. I lost another pair of lashes. They were the My Lashes But Better So Real Lashes. They were really pretty. And then, and then I used up, and I don't know where it went, but I used up my lip liner from LA Girl in Keep It Spicy. So I threw this box in here to remember that I used it up. And then um, used up this Clean It Zero Cleansing Balm. I really like this one. I just reordered one. So yeah, used that up, you guys. And there's only one more product that's left on the floor. Oh no, look, here's the lip liner. It fell out of the basket. Then the last thing I used up was a cleaning product. It was the Lysol Toilet Bowl Cleaner. Um, yeah, so ever since I've been doing my Swish and Swipe, I use this multiple times a week and it's been working lovely. Not Can't complain about it. I mean, it cleans the toilet pretty well. I was using a natural toilet bowl cleaner. It's not worth it. I mean, I'd rather just clean the bathroom myself, you know, use the chemicals because that natural toilet bowl cleaner just wasn't getting the job done. But I'm going to empty all this back into the basket so I can dump it and then I'll be right back. All right, you guys, that is it for today's product empties video. Again, like I said, that is like two months worth of stuff. Um, once we're in, once we're settled and done into our new house, I won't be piling things up this long. Like I said, it's just been time really hard to find time to sit down and film. I'm going to try to pre-film this week for next week because we should, and you know, Lord willing, by the grace of God, we should be moving into our new house next week. I'm going to try to do everything within two days. So get moved within one day, get unpacked within the next day. I did it whenever we moved here and I'm determined to do it whenever we move into our next house because it's a move in ready and I'm so thankful for that. Um, there's just some things we gotta work on outside the house. But yeah, so I'm determined to do that. Not sure if I'll be able to pre-film just with um, the kids being sick and everything this week. I'm going to try to find the time. And I also don't know what to film. I have a Jesus chat, but I don't know what to film um, beauty or lifestyle wise. So go ahead and let me know what you guys might wanna see. Um, I do have some makeup, com makeup coming in from Ulta. So maybe I'll just do like a little chit chat, get ready with me or do like a little um, Instagram chooses my makeup type of deal. I think I'm gonna do that. And so I'll post that um, Wednesday and try to film everything on Friday. So yeah, I love you guys, but always remember that Jesus loves you more. If you have not already, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Also, hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Mwah.